Good morning, fancy friends. Good morning, everybody. How are you today? Welcome, welcome. Happy Wednesday, everyone. Good morning, fancy friends. It's pajama Drisco day. <laughs> so, so come in your pajamas, grab your coffee, and join me, and let's do some chit chatting and finish a project we were starting. We started yesterday. Hello, everybody. And if you're watching this and you don't see that red like button in the corner, that means you're watching on the replay. And if you are, if you just put in the comments. Hashtag replay, just so I know you're watching and I could say hello to you. Hello, everybody. My name is Kim from Yesterday's Tomorrow's. And here on this page, we have fun, we chit chat, we make beautiful home decor projects, and uh, we just like to have fun here. So, welcome, everybody. And let me just scoot you down a little bit. There we go. All right. And if you're here, guys, please say hello so I know you're watching and I can say hello to you. And if you're new to the page, please just let us know that you're new so we can welcome you. Hey, Tammy, how are you, sweet friend? Hello, hello. Tammy, did you get your um, happy mail? I hope. Hello, Dawn, how are you? Good morning, everybody. Is everybody in their pajamas, guys? I'm in my pajamas. Good morning, Patty Little, how are you? Remember, it's pajama dress code day. Isn't, isn't that a fun mug? <laughs> I found this in... Um, in home goods. Good morning, Lisa. How are you? And um, my friend Sandy is here. Hello, sweet, fancy friend Sandy. How are you? Thanks for coming on today. Thank you for your message yesterday. Um, you're so sweet. Um, look at that pajama dress code. Thought it was so much fun. Good morning. Yes, cheers. So what is what what is your drink of the morning? Mine is tea. I'm a teetotaler, I guess. Hi, Jesse from Australia. Um, I know most people drink coffee. I'm a tea person. Good morning, Sandy. I'm so happy you're here today. You made my day. You made my morning. <laughs> you all made my morning. Hello, Angie. Oh, thank you for the stars, everyone. Thank you so much. Coffee and PJs. Francis, are you in your PJs? I hope so. Angie, hello, good morning, coffee. Coffee, most people are coffee, most people are coffee. And I'm just a plain old Lipton tea drinker. No fancy teas for me. Hello, Lisa, how are you? Oh, Patricia, you drink your coffee, you drink your tea too? Yay, I got another tea person. Good morning, Mara. Wow, it's really early for you. <laughs> Thanks for stopping by. Mara, you must be in your PJs. Oh, and you're in bed, good. <laughs> Good. Folgers breakfast blend. Uh, my husband likes that too. He likes that too. Somebody sent me once this big thing of teas and I, I don't, I'm not like a fancy tea person. I'm just not plain old lifted tea. Yes. And your PJ's good. I'm in my robe, just making my coffee. Edie said, good, good. Oh my God. Isn't this fun? Good morning, Sherry. We're going to have to do this more often. Pajama dress code. Good morning, Sherry. Good morning, Tarita. Well, we have a lot of fancy friends here We're in their PJs and they're drinking their coffee. I'm at a doctor's appointment. Well, um, Sandy, prayers for you. Ah, prayers that everything goes well in your doctor's appointment, Sandy. Thank you for stopping by. Um, I appreciate that. And you put a smile on my face. Thank you, Sandy. All right, everybody. So let's get going. Oh, Mara, I have a, since you were on here, I have a question for you, sweetie. I was going to PM you, you yesterday. Um, I just have a question. We're using today, ta-da, we're using the Fine Line Crackle Varnish. Hello, Kim, how are you? So um, this is a project we did yesterday that we have to finish. Isn't that so pretty? My question was, and I was going to, um, I was going to um, call you, my sweet friend, if I was going to, and this way everybody will know that answer, since I don't know everything at all. I don't know everything, but my friend Mara does. <laughs> um, I tore the paper around here. If I wanted to put dark wax around here for the edges. Would I put that, Could if I already put this down, can I still put the wax or do I have to put, I have to, um, or can I put down this down after? That's my thing. I was wondering. As I was looking at it last night, I said, oh, it probably be nice with a little bit of dark wax on there. But I'm like, oh, I already put this down. I don't know if I can put the dark wax down. So um, if you know the answer to that, um, wax is lit. Oh, so I can, the wax is, oh, okay. So I can put it down after the antique paste. Gotcha. Gotcha. Thank you. I knew you would know it, Mara. You're so sweet. All right, guys, if you popped on, if you didn't sh come on yesterday, let me show you what I did. Um, I got some new Decoupage Queen papers. I'm a retailer for Decoupage Queen. So let me show you real quick. Um, this is the one. 
<gasps> Look how pretty that is. Thank you, Mara. Mwah, you're so sweet, my sweet friend. There we go. Um, this is this is the paper I used yesterday. Now it comes in a big sheet like this. Let me show you the big ones first. Let me just show you real quick if you didn't see the new ones I got yesterday. Um, it comes in a big sheet like this. But look at this one, guys. Oh, is this beautiful? Oh, I am so sorry um, about your dad. Prayers, prayers, honey. Um, sorry about your loss. She always says the steps and I mix them up. Well, this is on this one. You get if you purchase these, it says number one and number two. And I'm glad about that because I won't get them mixed up. Um, there we go. Look at this, how pretty that is. So this paper had the same thing. See how it has. But I will use the big one. But look at that paper. Isn't that beautiful? Let me just show you the new ones I got. Oh, <gasps> Mara, don't you love this one? OMG, love it, love it, love it. Love it, love it, love it. But guys, Mara, I've got this one because I, I'm a bingo fan. I love bingo. When I go on my cruises, I play bingo. So I got this. Oh, is that fun? Someone said, Mara, now I did not see your video, that you did this on a t-shirt. So I am going to have to watch the replay and see how you put these on t-shirts. But guys, isn't this fun? Bingo. Oh my gosh. When I go on cruises, it is bingo time. All right. See you later. <laughs> I said, good morning, Marlene. How are you? So Mara, I have to, um, I have to see how you did that. Hello, Laura. How are you? Thanks for joining. But look how cute. How cute that is. So Mara, I got to watch how you put that on a t-shirt. Love my bingo. I but I haven't, I love bingo, but I haven't had did bingo since I cut, uh, haven't been on a cruise. So, and then this one, look guys, look how beautiful that one is. Isn't that so pretty? And then, so those are some of the big ones I have. I'm just going to show you real quick in case you missed my video yesterday, guys. Yes. Thank you everybody. Um, for doing that. Yes, we are so sorry for your loss. I, I My dad passed away two years ago, and uh, I know how it feels. I miss him so. I miss him so. Okay, so here we go. And oh, Christmas, guys, it's never too late. Christmas, look at this beautiful one. Ah, <gasps> oh, vintage, right? Hello, Tamara. Good morning. Good morning. It's pajama dress code. Hope you have your pajamas on. We all do. I have my pajamas on. If you're wondering, why does she dress like that? I guess I could wear this out of the house. Who would know, right? Well, I don't know. Uh, guys, do you do this when it's winter, right? And you wake up in the morning and you got to run out of the house and you got your pajamas, but you got your pajamas on. You just put a coat on and you leave and you go to the house. Who knows you got your pajama top underneath there, right? <laughs> Am I telling my secrets? <laughs> I mean, we have, might have to change your pants if they, if they're not, if they don't really look like pants, but I mean, here here in the north, we do that. We just throw a coat on and who knows? Nobody knows what you got underneath there. <laughs> yes, Marlene, I still sell uh, Prima. And actually, guys, on my site, Prima, I have a sale 25% off all Prima um, transfers and decoupage sheets. Okay, and there we go. Look at that Santa. Uh, yeah, so guys, on my, on my website, uh, I have re I'm a retail for redesign with Prima. And I have 25% off of it. <gasps> Look, guys, is this not me or what? Yikes. <gasps> Tammy, isn't that Santa? Oh, my gosh. You know me and my vintage Santas. Look at that. Now, um, not molds. I, I don't even know if I have any molds on there. I, I know they're mostly sold out. So you can kind of, you can look, Marlene. Um, I, I can't, you know, I'm, I'm just a little small little uh, retailer here. So I can't get every single paper they have. I just get what I like and what jumps out at me when I see them. This jumped out at me. Look, guys, right? Look at that. Oh, you've done that multiple times. <laughs> yeah. You just put your coat on, leave. Who knows what you got on underneath there? <laughs> Hello, Vanessa. How are you? Oh my gosh. My friend Vanessa's here. She's my she is my neighborhood friend. I grew up with her in West Orange, New Jersey. And she lives now down in Florida. Hello, Vanessa. Okay, and look at that paper. Isn't that beautiful? Gorgeous. And then look at this one, guys. Is this not me? <gasps> look at that. Now you could do four projects with that. One, two, three, four. Isn't that beautiful? Um, let me just tell you something about my website, guys. When you go on there, the price that you see um, for anything is the price that you're going to pay. There's no um, hidden, not hidden. 
just know when you go there, then there's going to be a price for the shipping and the handling and all that kind of stuff. Everything's included in the price. So just say if, um, I don't know, I don't have this on my website, but if this was $4, when you go to pay, it's $4. So that's it. Um, it'll say free shipping on the bottom when you go for shipping. So whatever the price is that you see when you pull your your um, product up, that is the that will be the full price that you're going to pay for at checkout. Just so you know. Thank you, Linda. I appreciate it. Okay, so let's get going. All right, so let me show you what we did yesterday. This is just a charger um, that I got at a, at a white elephant sale. Hello, Tamara, and. and um, it still has a sticker on it, I have to take off. So whoever, whoever get it to the White Elephant sale got it at TJ Maxx. But isn't that so pretty? So let me show you the color. I use this color, my favorite, from um, Pink Couture. It's called Vintage Moss. Oh, okay, Mara. See you later. Go get your coffee. Thanks for joining. And thank you for answering my questions, Mara, my sweet friend. Um, I will see you later. Is there a link for my website? If you go um, on my Facebook page, go into Linktree, and my Linktree will give you my website. If not, um, as soon as I'm done this, I will put my Linktree in the descriptions. Um, Mr. FB doesn't like you to put links in your descriptions before you go out live. Um, they will not put your reach out there so much. So, ooh, so this is the only reason why I don't have it in there. Good morning, Nora. Hello, James. How are you? So um, it's in my Linktree, guys. So this is Vintage Moss. That's what we painted it in. And um, then we put the um, beautiful, beautiful. Oh, let me, hold on, guys. Let me scooch you down. Hello, James. How are you? James, my number one fan. James is Nora's grandson, and he is my number one fan. So, hello, James. Now, I know you can't see me, guys, but you just need to see the project that we're doing. Okay, so what we did was we painted this in vintage moss, okay? The middle part here, I painted in white because I wanted this, make sure your decoupage paper pops. You can see the color that it's intended it to be. And I did it in the color Angelic. Um, All Paint Products is a company that I'm affiliated with, my new company, I love them. They're also on my, um, in my link tree. If you put in the code YES10, you will get 10% off your order. And then what I did was I decoupaged the print on there. Good morning from Monmouth County. Hello, Mo Ma Rosemary. Yay, a New Jersey girl. Yay. I love we have New Jersey people on. Welcome. All right, so I decoupaged that on there. Then we are doing fine line, fine line crackling, guys. Okay. So this, this is also on my website right here. And this is it. It's Pentart, guys. Okay. It, it's two steps. So we, this is why we're coming on today. Okay, so first I put on this, the fine line crackle medium, okay? We put one coat, watching from hot and dry Missouri. Beautiful charger, thank you. Hello, welcome Missouri. Hello, hello Debbie from Texas. I just saw the news guys, in Texas it's still in the triple digits, so please stay safe, stay cool. I heard that Deb, it's still hot. Dallas is 103 today, yikes. It got finally got cool in New Jersey. Hello from North Carolina. Hello, Jade. How are you? All right. So we put this down. It's fine crackle medium. I know, Deb, I heard it's so hot. I uh, My prayers go out to you guys. You get some relief soon. So when you do this, and this is this goes on like a Mod Podge, guys. This is exactly what it, it looks like when you go to put it on. It's like a Mod Podge. The thing with this, though, guys, okay, it's just white. It's like a Mod Podge. When you put this down, you it tells you you are not allowed to dry it with a heat gun, a heat machine. You're not allowed to do that. You need to let it air dry for 24 hours. So that's why, I mean, yes, you can do it with the heat machine, but you have a chance of bubbling it and what and a bunch of stuff. So me and Mara agree that um, it's just best to kind of just let it alone. So that, that's where we are today. We put that, we put step one down. Now we're putting step two, and this is what makes the magic happen. Fine line crackle varnish. Now this you can do with your heat machine, okay? So we're gonna put a coat of, coat of that down, and then after we do that, we're going to dry it, and all the little crackles are gonna start appearing. How fun is that, okay? And then you, when you put the, you see the crackles coming, you're not, they're not gonna be pronounced until you put a wax 
or we're going to today, we're going to put an antique paste down. So let's put this in. Let's, let's get this. Okay, so my decision when I did yesterday, I wasn't sure if I was going to do the whole thing um, in, for the fine line crackle. I did, except for the very, if you're going to show you the border, guys, can you see the border, how pretty that is? So I didn't do the border. The border, we're going to do some gold on. So I left that alone. But this has it on it. This has it. I just left that alone. So we're, that is going to, we're going to put some gold on that. I thought that would make it fancy. Okay, so, oh, ooh, it opened. I tell you guys, please open up your stuff ahead of time. I tell me, open up your stuff ahead of time. This way you're not fooling around with it, or sometimes I can't get it open. And uh, I forgot to do that yesterday. Okay, so let's put that on, and let's get that going. There we go. And you just put it on, just like if you're going to put on a top coat or anything like that. And you want to make sure you get it on everything. Now you're going to be able to tell if you lift it up like in in a light you're going to see if you missed the spot um it's going to it's going to look it won't look shiny to you there we go just like that and if i miss a comment i apologize guys and if, if you see a newbie come on and they're letting us know they're a newbie um you guys know if you could please um just welcome them to our page i appreciate it Sometimes I miss it, but then I, I try to go on at night at night um, um, and see the comments. And if they said they're new, I, I always try to welcome them to the page. But sometimes Facebook does not give every single comment. Yay, you're doing the hearts. Oh, I didn't even have to. You guys know the drill. You guys are the best. You know the drill about Mr. FB not giving notifications to the rest of our fancy friends. And that makes the the page go out a little bit more and hopefully it will go on their page their um it will go in their feed oh thank you thank you everybody for the hearts and the mo any um, any emoji will do <laughs> you could even do wow or well i don't want a sad face <laughs> or a laughing face any emoji will work it just doesn't have to be a heart <laughs> Hello, Patricia. How are you? Thank you, everybody, for joining me today. Okay. Now, you can also, if you want to, you can let this dry by itself for 24 hours, and it'll crackle for you. But, you know, who wants to wait? It was eating me alive yesterday, not knowing I couldn't, um, I, I couldn't finish this. You know when you start a project and you want to get it done? You want instant that instant, instant gratification and with this you can't get it because this you have to let it dry on its own thank you kathy how are you thanks for thank you for the hearts yes guys and in the comments just keep commenting you don't even have to say a word just put hearts or thing in the comments too and um that helps the feed too so thank you everybody uh, okay so now what i'm gonna do is i'm kind of lifting it up like that and I'm going to see if I see, oh, there we go. See, I see a part right here that looks like I didn't get it on there. So what I'm doing here is I'm just going through the light and I'm seeing if I missed a spot. If you hit it in the light, guys, you'll be able to tell if anything looks dry. There we go. All right. So that looks, I think that's looking pretty darn good. Okay. So now let's start. The magic, let's see what the magic happens. Now this sometimes takes a little bit. All right, so let me get my gun working here. Go. There we go. And let's, let's get it started. Okay, well, while that's happening, let me scooch up a little bit. There we go. And then I'll put you down. Thank you, Brenda. I know, it's so pretty. I just love the print. It's so beautiful. Thank you. It's really, really pretty. Oh, I love the crackle. I'm starting to see it a little bit. I'm starting. This is the this is the this is the part where the magic happens. Now you're going to start to see the crinkling, and it, you're going to say, "Ooh!" But this will look very, very pronounced. You won't look very pronounced until you put your wax, or as I'm putting on today, the antique paste. The antique paste is what's going to make. It's going to go into the cracks, and it's going to make the cracks more pronounced. So you'll see. 
put it down. It's starting. It's starting. There we go. And guys, while I have you on here, while we're waiting, while we're waiting for paint to dry. <laughs> Hello, Kathy. How are you? Thanks for joining us today. Um, can I ask a huge favor? Can I ask a huge favor? I now have a Pinterest page. It's called Yesterday's Tomorrow's. How many of you are on Pinterest? How many of you go down the rabbit hole of Pinterest at night? I do. About 10 o'clock at night. You want to know where your fancy, fancy leader is? She's on Pinterest scrolling and scrolling and scrolling and trying to get inspiration um, and that's what I do I just love Pinterest um, thank you uh, thank you Debbie I know you do thank you um, I have a pin and it's it's the last idea pin I did and it's a it's an arrow that says pumpkins pick your own 15 cents on a wreath I have, a, I have a goal that I want to achieve, and I need 100 saves. I only need 55 more. I need the saves by Ju July 30th, though, guys. There's a deadline. So, guys, if you could do me a favor, if, you have a, if you're on Pinterest, if you could save it, it needs to be a save, guys, not just a heart. If you want to give me a heart, too, I would love it. Thank you, Kathy. Yes, if you could please follow me, and then please, if you could save that pin. It needs to be a save. I have a goal, and I need 100 saves. So if you could do that for me, I would appreciate it. Thank you, Edna. I know you guys would do that for me. Thank you. I only need 55 more saves to reach my goal. So thank you. I appreciate it. You And when you're on there, thank you, Nora. You usually find all my projects on there, guys, too. You'll find I usually pin all my stuff to there. I love Pinterest. I'm always, was always on there. And I finally said, well, let me start and make a page and put my stuff out there. And it's so cool to finally see stuff that I've done on Pinterest. I mean, I've been on there for such a long time. And now to see my own stuff on there, it's pretty, it's pretty darn darn cute. And Deb, I see your stuff on there too. Guys, and my friend Deb from Art and Grace, she's got a page on Pinterest. And if you're on there, if you want to go follow her and see all her stuff, it's amazing. Thank you, Jade. I appreciate it. Oh, guys, I'm seeing cracking. I am seeing cracking. Oh, it's hard for you to see. Hello. Oh, you're doing good, Grace. I mean, Deb, you're doing good. Deb, you are doing good. I see it. I see them. And it takes a lot of time, especially the video ones, you know. You got to download the video. You got to upload the video. You got to edit your video. You got to take pictures. <gasps> Debbie, yes, thank you. Thank you, Shirley. Thank you. Oh, you guys are amazing. I knew you would help me out. And guys, when I do hit my goal of 100 saves, I will do a gift away. How's that? We will do a gift away of a decoupage cream paper. Yay, so thank you. If I can get that. Oh, I, you know, it's so funny. Uh, I don't know why, but it pops up on my phone. If somebody follows me or saves something, it's it shown me. And there we go. Deb, you just saved it. Thank you. <laughs> Start to put, it'll start to tell me who saved it and uh, who has followed me. Thank you, ladies. <laughs> oh, you guys are amazing. Thank you. Thank you. You know, it's just the picture's not the greatest on there. Oh, yeah, yeah. I can't really tell it's an arrow. <laughs> you know, I take the picture and I put it into Canva and I put the dimensions it needs to be and then the whole bit and then. Um, it didn't fit into the screen and I didn't notice until you you submitted it and after you submitted it you cannot change your mind thank you Jade it just said that Edna thank you thank you Jade for saving <laughs> yes it's, it's the pin that has the wreath that has a orange arrow that says pumpkin say, uh, buy your pick your own for 15 cents 
Thank you. Let's see. Oh my gosh. <gasps> Guys, it's crackled. Let me make sure that this is dry. Ooh, and this is this is hot though. So we have to wait just a second. But I don't let me bring it up to you and let me see. Let me see if you can see. Can you guys? Oh, there we go. Guys, can you see the crackling? Look at there we go. See the where the light is shining? Can you see that crackling? Give me hearts if you can see the crackling. I hope I'm showing if you can see it. Oh, it's so there we go. See the way there we go. Can you see that crackling there? Da, there we go. You can see it. Good. Okay. Yay. I just want to make sure. Okay. Yes. It, it crackled. Oh, I am thrilled. 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 All right. So now we're going to use now to fill in. So now you have these cracklings. And what they have is they have like, the where it crackles, this is like a little divot in, in it. And you want to fill that in. Now, just say if this was black, you might want to use a white wax or some kind of white um, antiquing glaze or paste. Um, I have this, this is called um, antiquing paste and this is in bronze, guys. I did have it on my website. I am out of it, um, but I will, try, I will try to get some more. But you can use any kind of glaze or anything like that, anything that's going to seep into your cracking. So let me put it down a little bit more. There we go. So now you can see. Thank you, Kathy. I appreciate you. You guys are amazing. I appreciate it all so much. Like I said, if I can get, as soon as I get the 100 saves, um, we will do a gift away of some, maybe some decoupage green paper. All right. So let me, hold on. Let me get, all right. I'm going to need some paper towels to rub it in. There we go. And then you just need a little brush. I just take a small artist brush. Hello, Sherry. How are you? And then I'm going to take this. Oh, I'm not shaking this. This is, this is like a paste, so this doesn't shake. Okay, there we go. So let's start doing that. And then once you put this on, you're going to start really seeing the crackling, guys. This is going to be so pretty. It's still a little... Hold on. It's still warm. <gasps> Hold on, let's get it cooler. What's the weather by you for today, ladies? Here it's gonna be 80 degrees sunshine and low humidity. Perfect, perfect summer day. Perfect summer day here today. So I'm thrilled. Hold on, let me take a remember pajama dress code. We have to definitely do this more often, but isn't that the funnest mug? <laughs> when I saw that in Home Goods, I said, I have to get it for my fancy friends, for the morning time. There we go. Maybe I should come on in the morning and in the afternoon. Now today, guys, I'm not gonna be on my page at three o'clock. Um, one of our fellow crafters broke their leg and we are filling in for her on her page. So I'm on my friend Terry's, cra Terry's Crafty Creations um, and I'm gonna be on her page at three o'clock. So. If you want to go on her page and see me, I'll be there. Okay, so now you just put it on just like that. And then you take your rag just like that. And I'm going to show you. I'm going to lift the camera up in a minute, guys, to show you what it looks like on the part that I don't have it on. And then you can see the part that it's on. And you just rub it in. And when you got it like that, get it to a clean spot to get off the excess. Or you're just rubbing around more of the product there we go oh can, there, we, there we go can you see the crackling look there we go no wrong spot see ah uh, can you see there we go can you see the crackling in there see this side no crackling this side with the crackling see that and look how it makes it look so aged 100 in washington oh yikes we had the hundreds in here last week and boy you couldn't even go outside. Thank you. You couldn't even go outside. I said, you might as well be having a snowstorm and stuck in your house because when it's that hot, you can't go outside. You just can't. You can't even breathe. So yeah, I just apply it with an artist brush, guys. I don't know. I guess you can apply it with whatever you want, the product, but I just apply it with this. You're just trying to get it into the nooks and crannies of your crackle. That's all, but this is, it's really easy to do and it's fun. Um, it's just, you know, it just takes a little time because you have to let that other part dry, guys. 
There we go. Whoop. Let me get. It. Let me just get another one. There we go. Oh, it looks so pretty. Okay, so now let's do let's, we'll do this edge right here. I want to see what that's going to look like with the crackling. And then we're going to put the gold around the edge. And for the gold, I'm going to use um, Liquid Leaf, another one of my absolute favorites. 96, having rain. We need rain. Oh, gosh. We had rain the other day, but not enough. We're still in a drought. Um, the town over now you can only water your flowers um, on certain days I think it's or your lawn I should say um, every other day so we are we're in a drought here in New Jersey well in the western northern part of New Jersey anyway I don't know about the rest of New Jersey I shouldn't say okay so let's go and let's Oh, this is so pretty. I'm glad I decided to do Remember, if you saw my video yesterday, I wasn't sure about doing this top part with the crackling, but I'm glad I did. Okay, you need another one. Oh, it looks so pretty with the crackling around the edge, guys. Thank you for telling me to do it around the edge because it really makes it it really makes it. And I'll lift this up, guys, in a minute and show you. Let me just finish the whole thing, and I'll show you what it looks like around the edge. But it's so pretty. So, yeah, you could. So, I have this on my website, guys, if you're interested. It's under Pentart. The name, Pentart, the name of that. I do have it on my, in, on my website. And my link is on my Facebook page under Linktree for my website. Okay, there we go. Let's get that on there. And then we're just going to put it on the rest of this. And then we're going to do the edge in the gold there. And that'll just make the edge stand out a little bit more. There we go. And just rub it in. There we go. I don't even need as much product as I'm using on here, but that's okay. Let me see. You guys are intently watching me. <laughs> I must be a good teacher. I don't see any comments unless I'm not getting them. Okay, let me get some more paper towels. Let me keep those up there. Okay, so you just want to rub off the excess that you have on there. And you want to let this dry for 24 hours. And then after it dries, guys, you do have to put a coating on top. And then you need a coating of something, oh, and I can't think of the word of it, that has this chemical in it. But anyway, what the coating that I'm going to put on here, guys, is Rust-Oleum 2X Spray Paint in Clear, guys. Um, I'll use, you could use any kind of, um, any kind of finish you want. Um, I'll just use satin. Um, I wouldn't use matte, uh, guys. I find, I find matte is not as strong. Um, as as satin or gloss, so I'll use. But it, um, but you need to put a sealer on, and if it, if the sealer stinks, <laughs> this is what my friend Mara said. If the sealer stinks as a smell to it, then you know it's good to use. <laughs> so I use the Rust-Oleum spray paint clear, so Rust-Oleum 2X spray paint in the clear in satin, and that's what I will. Um, spray it with but you got you want to wait 24 hours to do that okay so i'm just going to give this another rub just to make sure i get all the excess off let's see there's still a little bit more left on there there we go all right so let me and i hope i don't know let's see if you can see the crackling on the edge there we go uh can you see the there we go it's hard to see the with the lights and everything in the studio here the crackling on the edge but it's on there and it'll and it really, this really, you would never know it's a plastic black charger, guys, right? I mean, look at that. You would never know. All right, so now let's put our gold liquid leaf on the round the edges. You know what that is, guys. Guys, are you familiar with this product? Have you used it before? Tell me in the comments, have you used liquid leaf before? Um, if you've watched my page, you know I have. It's like one of my favorites. A clean brush, yes, okay. 
Now remember, this is not this is not oil, this is oil based, guys. So it is smelly. So if you have somebody with breathing problems or anything like that, you might want to put a fan on or something if you're doing it close to them because it does have a strong odor to it. Okay, so now let's. Is this going? Yeah, there we go. Okay, so now let's paint this. Oh, this is this is what's gonna make it, guys. Yeah, there we go. And this highlights the outside of it so well. And I saw this charger at the White Elephant sale. I'm like, oh, for a charger, it just was so pretty, the edging. And I knew I could do something with it, and I was waiting for these papers to come. Okay, let me just show you real quick. Look at the edge. Isn't that, look how pretty it looks with the gold on there. Doesn't it look gorgeous? <gasps> Thank you, Teresa. I know, so pretty. So guys, you don't have to spend a real, lot, lot of money on, go to the thrift stores, go to the, you got some white elephant sales going on in your area. Um, I'll tell you the Goodwills around me though, I don't know, they've gotten very expensive. Um, do, do any of you go to Goodwills? And how are they, how are the prices in your area? Um, my sister went the other day and they had like a, um, like a white dish that she said, Kim, you could get it anywhere for like $5. And they wanted $9 in Goodwill for it. And she's like, what? She goes, that's like the price that you would pay in home goods. She was so, so surprised. And I haven't been to that, the one she's talking about in a long time. So I was wondering if it's just the prices here that have gone up or um or is it everywhere i don't know <gasps> let's see hello stock exchange how are you your store is looking beautiful guys my friend tammy she owns a store in sparta new jersey it's called the stock exchange and uh she has been open for a month now she's opening at the end of august she was well, you know, you can, when you got a store like that, you got to close it all down when you need to redo the floors, you need to repaint. You can't do that when your store is open. So she has been closed. So when it's open, we are going to go and we're going to do, we're going to go on a field trip there, guys. You've seen me before do a field trip there. We're going to do a field trip at her store and see it all done. She said it's going to be magical. It's going to be all filled with fall. I don't know. Is it going to be filled with Christmas? Um, the... The, the decoupage queen papers are not on sale. It's just the redesign with Prima. Redesign with Prima decoupage papers and redesign with Prima um, transfers are 25% off, not the decoupage queen. I'm sorry if, I, if, I, um, if you misunderstood. Yeah, decoupage queen papers are not on sale. It's just the decoupage, redesign with Prima is 25% off. So I, sorry if I, if I uh, did not say that correctly. And the paper that I'm using today is under the decoupage queen. Good morning, Sienna. How are you? Thank you for joining. And thank you again, everybody, for saving that pin for me. Like I said, as soon as we get to 100 saves, I will be doing a gift away. Um, and I'll do some decoupage queen paper. Okay, so guys, if you just joined, I'm trying to get 100 saves on a pin on Pinterest. My page is Yesterday's Tomorrow's, and it's the one with the arrow, the orange arrow that says pumpkin, pick your own 15 cents. Let's see. Um, it's Redesign with Prima, Karen. Go on my website, and you'll see Redesign with Prima. Um, it's on my website. My website you can find on my link tree. It says website. Go on, click onto that. It'll take you right to my website and you'll see redesign with Prima um, transfers and there'll be another button for redesign with Prima um, decoupage sheets. So I hope you can find it. <gasps> Thank you. Um, let's see, hold on a second, guys. If I'm missing, let me see what the comment was. Um, oh, I'm sorry, guys. If you, if I miss, if I'm missing your comments, I do go back at the, at, um, at night and I will answer your questions. If I don't answer your question, sometimes Facebook does not give it to me. And if you, if you want to know the answer, private message me. And, um, then I, I definitely get it and I will definitely. 
definitely get back to you. Yeah, but my the, it's uh, I am a retail for Redesign with Prima, and my transfers are twenty five percent off, and it's on my website in my link tree, which my link tree is located on my webs on um, my Facebook page. I will put it in as soon as I'm done this. I will put um, the link to my link tree in the descriptions of this video, guys. I would do it ahead of time, but Facebook they don't like it, and they don't they don't put your video out there as much. When you're live, if you put a link, they don't want you leaving the page. <laughs> That's what it is. Can you imagine? They don't want you leaving the page. So, yes, in my link tree. It's in my link tree. On my face, on my Yesterday's Tomorrow's Facebook page, you'll see a link for the link tree. And if you hit that, you'll see all my affiliate stores I'm affiliated with. Um, and it's you'll see a, a, little, a little tab that says, that'll say, um, Website. I know, doesn't it? It makes it look even older. This looks like something I would see when, um, at my grandmother's house when I was growing up. Isn't this so pretty? Oh, just gorgeous. Just so pretty. Thank you, Jade. Now, let me get this dry and then I'll lift it up and then you guys can see it even better. Now I will go, um, once this is all done, I will um, do the back. I will paint the back. I'm just going to paint it in this, um, in the vintage moss. I'm not going to put any gold or anything like that, but I don't, really, I don't like that the, that the back. I like to finish my products, projects on both sides. This is gonna, I'm gonna put this on a plate. Somebody asked me yesterday, am I gonna hang this? You could hang it. I guess if you could get one of those, um, what do you call those? Commander hooks? But I think I'm gonna put it in a really pretty gold plate stand. Uh, you've, you've seen those before. They have them in Hobby Lobby. They have some really pretty decorative ones. But I'm gonna put it, oh, and actually I have one over there. Let me go get it and I'll show you. It's not really gold, it's a bronze color, but I'll show you how I'm gonna display it. This stuff is smelly. <laughs> Thank you, Lisa. I appreciate it. Thank you, ladies. Yes, I can't wait to get to the 100 save, and I will can't wait to do my gift away. Is that dry? So look, guys. <gasps> is it dry? Yeah. <gasps> Doesn't that look so pretty? Hold on. Let me get... Is it dry? Ugh. Yeah, it's still a little tacky, but hold on. Let me get the plate stand. Hold on one second, just so you can see how I'm going to display it. Hold on, let me go this way. I'm coming, I'm coming. Here we go. I probably would get maybe a one that's a little bit smaller, but you've seen these before, guys. They have these at Hobby Lobby. They have some really, really pretty decorative ones. This one's not so much. Um, actually, my sister got this. <laughs> we're, we're very into estate sales, garage sales, thrift stores, all that stuff. So she got that for like no, no money. <laughs> so, but I'd probably get more of a decorative one. And then... You could just put it right in the ball. Where am I? Is it there? Right in there. Hold on. There we go. Thank you, Donna. I know, and it looks so expensive. My gosh, right? And I think, there we go. And I think I, it was like I said, it was a white element sale. And there, you know, I think it was a quarter, 50 cents, something like that. So, but doesn't that come out so pretty? So if you, and if you just put this like on a sofa table or in your dining room, you don't see my, li my link tree on my Facebook page? It should be there. Um, Rhonda, wait till this video is done. And as soon as this video is done, I will put it in the description um, of this video. But isn't that, look how pretty that is, guys. <gasps> isn't that gorgeous with it? It's just so gorgeous. I'm so sorry that you can't find, you know, Facebook also has made, hold on, guys. Let me put you up a little bit. Um, there we go. Oh, um, Facebook has made changes to um the facebook pages everything's all different everything's moved around us um who have business pages are racking our brains out trying to figure out where everything has gone to you didn't find it either okay guys when i do get off of here um which pin do we save cindy the one that has, it's there's a wreath and it has an orange um arrow and it says pumpkins pick your own 15 cents that's the one 
Um, it's my last idea pin that I did that's on there. So thank you, Kathy. I appreciate it. Thank you. Um, but I will put in the descriptions, as soon as I get off of here, uh, if you go back on my Facebook page and you look for this video, it'll be in the description. It will be my link tree. I apologize. I know. I see you saving all my pins. Thank you. Hello, Dolores. How are you? We just finished the craft from yesterday, but don't worry. You're never late to my page. There's always, always replay. So you can see how um, I achieve this look. So this is the this is the stuff, Grace. You know, you've, you, you've seen me do um, crackling with the Elmer's glue, guys. You have, and I always, um, you don't have the about tab. Hmm. I know they've taken, they've taken stuff away or they moved it and I just don't know where to find it. So Rhonda, thank you for telling me that. And I will put in the descriptions, um, in the description of this video, my link tree. Um, but you see me use the Elmer's glue when I do the, um, crackling on like the big boards and stuff like that. But, but you cannot get this kind of crackling with that. This is fine line crackling. See that fine line crackling and that the, you, you can't get that with any other product. So, um, because I, I know you've you heard me say, don't use that expensive stuff to do crackling. I still believe that when you're doing crackling on um, the big projects where you just want like a rustic a farmhouse kind of a crackle. But when you want this kind of um, crackle. Oh, thank you, Lisa. Is that how you find it? I'm telling you, they just switched over. Thank you, Lisa. I appreciate that. But if you want these fine line crackles, this is the only thing that will achieve that. So just, uh, just an FYI. Ah, thank you, Dolores. Thank you. I'm glad you enjoyed my page. I know it's so much fun. I've been having a ball doing Pinterest, and I just want to let you know, all, you guys know all about it. Um, I just did it. I don't even know how long ago. I, I, I started it in January, bits by bits, but now it's um, constantly putting something up basically almost every day on Pinterest, and I'm having a ball with it. So, but, so like I said, this is the only product where you can, that you, you're going to be able to do the fine line crackling guys. Um, the Elmer's glue, which I love to do projects with, you're not going to get this, um, antique crackling with. Oh, Edie Innes. Oh, I don't know. I'm going to have to go look. You know, maybe some people it's different on, in different, um, pages sure you can post the link tree <laughs> you sure can you sure can uh, thank you Jade I appreciate it uh, but I will I will put I will put the the link in my in my description as soon as I get off of here guys I promise you I promise you so thank you guys thank you for joining me today um pajama dress code day this has been a lot of fun now if it would now i need to do a couple errands today i need to go to um the cleaners um <laughs> facebook keeps changing everything i know missy and this is a big one this is a big one it, so i had to, to put a video on watch yesterday and oh yeah yeah i'm telling you it was hard navigating through everything but, but if this was winter i just put a coat on and i'd be out the door <laughs> <laughs> now that I told you my secrets about winter, <laughs> sometimes I go out with my pajama top on. Oh, who knows what's underneath your winter coat, right? Here up here in the Northeast, uh, you're able to do that. <laughs> oh my God. But today, I, I it's summer. I need to change my shirt and put a regular shirt on. So, oh, thank you. There's my link tree. Mwah. Thank you, everybody. Thank you so much. All right, everybody. I will let you go. Have a beautiful and blessed day um if you could remember um also please keep um our fancy friends in your prayers um hold on a second. oh i don't know if you guys can see me there we go um keep our fancy friends in your prayers um god knows who needs them um i got a couple of private messages the other day um if they if I could be it. They could, uh, I can say, say prayers for some fancy friends. So please, there are some fancy friends that need our prayers. So if you can keep them in your prayers, I would, um, I'd be so happy. Thank you so much. Thank you. So go out, out. have a blessed day, everyone. Um, three o'clock. If you are around, um, you can, um, catch me on Terry's crafty creations. And I, 
believe that's it. I will put a link in um, and I will be on there at three o'clock this afternoon. Um, my friend Terry, she broke her leg and we're trying to keep her page up and running for her. So I will be on there today. All right, everybody. And thank you so much for all the saves on Pinterest. Mm, I love you all. Thank you. All right, everybody. Have a blessed day and um, I will see you tomorrow. I'm on iPhone right now. Yes, lots of prayers. We, there's so many people out there all that needs our prayers. So it, like I said, if you want a prayer said and if you would like me to say your name, let me know, private message me, and um, I can let our fancy friends know um, that, that you need some prayers. Um, I'd be so happy to do that for you. Thank you. I appreciate it. All right, everybody. God bless you. Have a blessed rest of your day, everyone.